How's everybody doing today? It's Robert from Cash's Treasures, and I got another great video for you today. I have a fan set. Well, it's kind of a, it's not really a fan set because it's an original set um, by the talented Robert Jimenez. Um, I have done some reviews in the past of his card sets. Uh, great work, uh, decent quality, um, and he reached out to me. Well, I mean, we spoke to each other. Um, and he said, Hey, you know, I got a new, uh, Kickstarter coming up, a starting lineup, uh, kind of baseball themed, um, uh, parody cards. Um, can I send you a set, uh, for you to review? And I said, sure. You send them over. Um, I'll do a review on my channel, um, and let everybody know, uh, you know, where they can pick up a set, uh, you know, of your, uh, your starting lineup. Um, so if you see at the very top, ZeroStreet.com. Uh, ZeroStreet.com is uh, his website. Um, so you can pick up all of his other great artwork on his website. Um, I will have a link below um, to, his, to his website as well. So it's Mr. Robert Jimenez. And ZeroStreet.com is his website. And this is his new starting lineup cards. Um, he did some great ones in the past. Um, he does a great, well, he did a great uh, Garbage Pail Kid series uh, set uh, that was really underrated. Um, the Garbage Pail Kids uh, Kitchen series, um, you know. So, and uh, that was, uh, was a great set. I love that set. And, um, you know, seriously underrated. And here's a little... Uh, you know, little doodle that he did. I appreciate it. Uh, Dead Ted's my favorite character. Um, and there you see at the top, the art of Robert Jimenez, ZeroStreet.com. And TikiTower.com as well. So we'll put that over here. And we'll pull some stuff out. And um, he did include, um, which I think is really cool, um, a couple, he did make wax wrappers for this series. Um, it's a it's a full set, so he didn't put them inside of the actual wax wrappers themselves. Uh, but this is really cool to see, you know, the actual uh, wax wrappers themselves here. Uh, really decent stuff. They are, uh, you know, really good quality, uh, you know, um, wax and paper. Uh, you know, to get everything, you know, good. So, and you see, um, he's got some little um, starting lineup t-shirts and more. Go to, uh, you know, his website there. You can see that there. If I can get it to uh, focus in. On the side here, uh, there's a website. Um, so you can pick up some uh, t-shirts and some other stuff and also on the side here get it to focus in uh has his um his website again but this is great quality stuff uh the wax feels really nice on here uh, i do love this and a couple postcards uh from some of the other stuff that he's done uh the tiki tower stuff um is tiki-tower.com um, he does a ton of, you know, of other artwork. And uh, I love the Tiki Tower stuff because it's, it's, um, it's kind of darker uh, stuff. Some postcards that he's done for that. But let's get into um, the starting lineup set. 36 cards plus one sticker. Uh, the box is awesome quality. Uh, I love, um, you know, and, and I've said it a hundred times that, um, what, what I love the most about fan sets is the time that people take and, you know, and, uh, put into, you know, the quality and workmanship, uh, and, and everything that they put out, you know, for, you know, for their specific sets. Um, and this is really great half bat boy starting lineup. You know, the person that, uh, you know, picks up the bats after the hitters hit um, is referred to as a bat boy. And so now this is actually half bat. 
So, awesome stuff. And let's take a look at uh, these cards here. And like I said, tremendous quality in the, the actual card stock itself. Um, I do love that. Um, it feels like an older baseball card. You know, not like the newer, like, you know, the old top stuff, you know, thick cardboard from back in the day, you know, not the, not what people refer to as tops paper, um, you know, because if you're not, if you're not buying chrome nowadays, um, you're, you're buying tops paper mostly, uh, but so we got starting lineup, um, itchy Willie Stubbs. And some back art on them. Uh, just basically gives you a little bit more information on the set itself. And this is a P1 card. Um, so. Awesome there. Telling you again, a 36 card set featuring bizarre ball players and a collection of the most vile products imagined. And that's at the very end. Um, so there's uh, some starting lineup baseball type parodies. Um, and this one right here, this is the next card for his next set. And I can't wait for this set. Um, I've done some stuff on his prior sets of Fearsome Weirdos. Um, but this is going to be Fearsome Weirdos, Kaiju Creeps. Uh, Kaiju basically is Japanese for uh, monster. Um, and so he does a parody on that, which is going to be super cool. Um, and this sticker that he get, well, the card that he uh, added right here is King Thong. So you see King Kong in his uh, nice little red thong there. So that's going to be his next card set. And, you know, I definitely can't wait for that. Uh, and there's a promo P2 card. Um, the third set in the Fearsome Weirdos trading card series. Look for Kaiju Creeps on Kickstarter in 2022. Awesome stuff. And then, like I said, I've done the first two series of, uh, you know, the Fearsome Weirdos. Um, so you can go on to um, his zerostreet.com website and pick up uh, his other card sets as well. Uh, you won't be disappointed in them, trust me. And like I said, I can't wait for Kaiju Creeps. And now let's get into the starting lineup stickers. Uh, 36 cards plus one sticker. Um, decent checklist on the back of uh, card number one. Um, and so you can see, uh, you know, all of the players that are in here, 36 cards in all. And you got Hank Iron. A outline on the back. Babe Tooth. Same outline. Stan Unusual. Ty Cobb. Dude, that looks crazy <laughs> with his head being an earicorn. Dude, his eyes are nuts. <laughs> Little hair sprouting out at the top. Joe Formaggio. Cheesehead. Tom Beaver. No Lids Ryan. He's got no eyelids, so his eyes are just like crazy, like bugging out. Pete Froze. Yeah, he's froze out of the Hall of Fame for a really long time. Veggie Jackson. <laughs> this glasses, man. <laughs> Oh, that's great. This hair coming out from underneath of the hat. And this was uh, the, the promo card, one that we got, Itchy Willy Stubbs.
Freddie Martin. Or Martian. Husan Forsid. And there's Half Bat Boy. That's awesome. I love it. Look at the teeth. His eyes are all going in two different directions. <laughs> I think this is probably my favorite card. Johnny Wrench. Look at just the look on his face. It was a great catcher, Johnny Bench, though. Mickey Dismantled. <laughs> Coach Roach. Yeah, that's that's got to come in really close second for uh, one of my favorite cards. I do like <laughs> I do like that. Giant bugs. Expired umpire. He's a zombie. Like his arm is falling apart and everything. Was that a tooth flying out? <laughs> Sty Young. Oh man, look at that giant sty. Gnarly fingers. Oh, man. That looks like people with bad toes. Ugh. Lou Block. He's just a block. You blockhead. Mel Otter. Vermin Munson. He looks like he might have rabies. Bone Puss Wagner. Catfish Hunted. Now this is the 36 cards in the starting lineup series. Now we go into a Wacky Packages type uh, set at the end, which is really great. I enjoyed this as well. Um, and I do like how he kind of mixed up uh, the set with a few different things. Kind of like, uh, you know, how Garbage Pail Kids kind of do his subsets and different stuff like that. And I do like the Wacky Packages style designs, uh, you know, in this 36 card starting lineup set. So let's take a look at these as well. Charleston Chaw, chocolate covered chewing tobacco. That just sounds nasty. And in the back, most vile products. <laughs> Swing and miss for Swiss Miss. Bunts, no tomato ketchup. Ah, oh, cricket jacks. Nice. Caramel coated popcorn, crickets, grasshoppers, and locusts. <coughs> A plague in every box. Man, I've eaten crickets. Sell them at the store. They're like nacho cheese flavored crickets. They actually don't taste like anything. Unless you get the legs stuck in your teeth. Pop jocks. Exploding candy. Taste the ninth inning. Jock strap flavored. Ugh. Mrs. Left Field. Nice cookies. Benches. Classic mustard for your dugout dog. 
Bush League baked beans made by amateurs. <laughs> home plate slider bread. All the taste of a dusty home plate. Strawberry shortstop. That's a good one. Look how angry she is. And we got Ball Sparks Franks. 100 volts per hot dog. Cool stuff. And that is the new series set by Robert Jimenez. Um, and like I said, um, if you enjoy this set, uh, definitely, you know, reach out to Robert on his website, um, zerostreet.com. Um, and he'll be happy to, you know, sell you a set and add it to your collection. Uh, great stuff. And like I said, I can't wait for his Kaiju Creeps to come out. Um, definitely looking forward to that one. But um, if you enjoyed this video, definitely give it a thumbs up. Uh, leave a comment uh, down at the bottom. And let me know if you like, uh, you know, fan sets. Uh, Robert Jimenez uh, artwork is super tremendous. Great stuff. Uh, so I can't say enough good things about him, uh, but you know, but, uh, zero street.com up there at the top is his website where you can go and purchase, um, the starting lineup set, um, as well as some of the other, uh, you know, uh, fearsome weirdo sets that he's done, uh, one and two already. Uh, but definitely, definitely, uh, you know, give him a shout, um, Definitely like to support, uh, you know, artists and the ventures and card sets that they do because uh, I'm a huge fan set. I love stuff that's privately put out. Uh, people put so much passion and time into it. And, uh, you know, I love that kind of stuff. So, but definitely give it a shot. Uh, you won't be disappointed. It's a well addition to any, uh, you know, non-sport card collection. Um, so, but if you like this video, definitely give it a thumbs up, leave a comment at the bottom, uh, tell me what, uh, favorite card that you had in this series, um, and if you're a baseball fan, what your favorite baseball player was, um, that'd be kind of cool to see, uh, see those as well. Uh, you know, I'm from New Jersey, so, uh, Mike Trout's always been a big, um, you know, big person in New Jersey, uh, so, not, actually not too far away from where I live now uh, is where he went to high school and everything. So, but so Mike Trout is definitely uh, a person in New Jersey, but, uh, leave a comment, hit that like button, subscribe. If you're not already, uh, getting close to, well, not really close, but, uh, getting there on 500 subscribers. Um, and then there'll be a ton of stuff, uh, that'll be giving away, you know, when we hit 500 subscribers. So, uh, I love all this stuff, and I'll keep making videos and keep putting stuff out, uh, and I appreciate every single one of you guys, and um, to all of uh, my subscribers that do celebrate, um, I want to say uh, Happy Easter. Uh, today is Easter, and uh, there's a lot of food being prepared at my house right now, so I can't wait to eat that later on, but always remember, have fun.